Yeah, I seen their video. We're talking about that tomorrow. We're talking about that tomorrow. Don't worry, though. I'm sure a bunch of people are going to say that I'm a pedo supporter because I'm going to call out their shitty fucking actions. They already had people saying it. They're absolutely horrible. And everyone who was saying, oh, maybe because you're a pedo, tonight you could eat a fucking dick. Fuck you. You know, I'm sure it was just trolling. I didn't even respond to them. But if you don't get why how they handle this is bad, you're stupid. Like like I said before, for those 4,000 people, or so, so, like on a dating app, an 18-year-old hit me up. First thing I fucking did, first off, it was weird, and I'll, I'll never do it again. But she hit me up, and the first thing I said, both before we even have a conversation, you need to show me a photo ID. I said that on Twitter, and people were like, oh, that's offensive. You shouldn't have to add. I'm like, what do you mean? Like, I'd rather be slapped across the fucking face than slapped with the... Hell yeah, man. If I question your age, I'm asking for an ID. I forgot the point I was making because the marijuana is starting to kick in, but... Like, like, what's the difference? You know what I mean? Like, they're kids. Even at 18, I got to agree with uh, Vosh. Vosh was saying this in the live stream. He's like... 18, okay, you're you're technically considered an adult in every state, but you're a fucking kid. Like, I see 18-year-olds, and I hear the conversation. Like, I, I, I just, you know. So, yeah, lesson learned with that one. But like I said, though, man, I made, I don't care if the app says 18+. plus. I made sure she was 18, and then she got really weird, and she sent me unsolicited pics of herself, which I didn't ask for, and then she was gone. She's like, yeah, I'm done. I don't want to do it. I'm like, okay, that's fine with me. Goodbye. You know, my thing is, if I have any doubts about your age, I need the CID, especially with what I do. And if you don't want to show me, fine, be offended. I'd rather walk away and, and go home and, and get, use my fleshlight. I don't own a fleshlight, but I'm just making a joke. But I'm bumps. Then God forbid, get in trouble. Sorry. I, I, I just... That's the thing. Show me your ID. You don't want to? Okay. Go. I'm going to go home and... I don't know. I can't think of anything right now. On Monday, you uploaded rubbing and kissing your chicken on you. My 11-year-old son watches. I need you to be a better role model for him. Okay. Yep. I'll, uh... I am a role model to the children. I will get on that right now. But this is a beautiful chicken. Anyone with Romeo and Juliet laws. What do you think? Yeah, as a person who on a dating app, like I just said before, was approached by an 18-year-old, which I made them verify that they were 18, I wholeheartedly hold with Vosh where the legal age of consent should be 20. Because that made me remember why I basically had a rule that ba anyone under 25 should be a no. And I'm like, yeah, yeah, now I get it. Now, yeah, now I understand. It doesn't matter if they're legal or not. They're still, like, an 18-year-old is a fucking child. I mean, it is what it is, dude. Like I said, I had a, a, wom a, a woman, 18-year-old, and I verified it on a dating app come up to me. Now, it was a weird experience. I never met her, would never, won't do it again, you know, but whatever, she's legal. I mean, and it was pretty much as bad as I thought it would be. It's like different worlds, but I just don't understand, like, oh, they're 16. Ooh, wow. I, I, it's something I can't have, so I have to go after it. Like, again, it's a psychological thing. They're fucked up. 50 pages that we didn't even bring. Yeah, but the difference between 16 and 18, though. Said? Like, why don't you just say, hey, I don't want to go to prison. Your face right here. I'll go for an 18-year-old. Right, like, man. you aren't that much different at 18 than you are at 16. Um, this is you, right? This you is, know? This is you. I'm not the sound. I'm not. He was in a... I mean, again, after that weird experience I have, I wouldn't even meet someone 18 plus. Like, I, I, I think, I think I'm gonna set my cutoff to like 23, if ever. But uh, it, it, I forgot what the fuck I was gonna say. Yeah, I think 20 worldwide should be like the minimum. That should be the age of consent is 20. I think 25 is a little extreme in the other direction. I think 18 is too young. I think 20. I think tw I would I would argue 20. Yes, I understand your brain isn't fully developed till 25, but look, <laughs> at eight, eight, well now it's 21 for cigarettes. At 18 you could get drafted. So hey, welcome to adulthood. Um and 21 you could drink. So I would say 20 would be yeah, why is 18 too young? 
Even though they're technically legally adults, you ever talk to an 18 year old, especially when you're older, like my age? They're kids, man. They're kids. On a dating app, an 18 year old hit me up. First thing I fucking did, first off, it was weird and I'll, I'll never do it again. But she hit me up and the first thing I said, Book, before we even have a conversation, you need to show me a photo ID. Rich, you are going to be 40 years old in two months. First thing you should be doing is not interacting with girls 22 years younger than yourself, you creepy bastard. So this establishes that Rich finds 18 year old girls physically and sexually attractive. Otherwise why would he bother asking for ID? Safe to say Rich likes them young. 18, okay, you're, you're technically considered an adult in every state, but you're a fucking kid. Like, I see 18 year olds and I hear the conversation, like, I, I, I just, you know. So, yeah, lesson learned with that one. But like I said, though, man, I made, I don't care if the app says 18 plus, I made sure she was 18. And then she got really weird and she sent me unsolicited pics of herself, which I didn't ask for. And then she was gone. She's like, it's clear Rich found this barely legal girl attractive. You don't ask girls you aren't attracted to for ID. Rich just said he considers 18 year olds to be kids. Then why the fuck did he ask her for ID? Also take note that never once did Rich comment that the girl may have looked too young for him. He only comments negatively on her personality. Like an 18 year old is a fucking child. You aren't that much different at 18 than you are at 16. Um, this is you, right? This you know? Is, this is you. I'm not the sound. I'm not. I agree with Rich here. 16 year olds look similar to 18 year olds. The difference isn't massive. Rich clearly found this 18 year old attractive otherwise he'd ignore her and not ask for ID. So that begs the question. Does Rich of Review Tech USA find 16 year old girls physically attractive? Although he doesn't admit it, if you put the pieces of the puzzle together it sounds like this. Like an 18 year old is a fucking child. You aren't that much different at 18 than you are at 16. On a dating app, an 18 year old hit me up. But she hit me up and the first thing I said, Book, before we even have a conversation, you need to show me a photo ID. Man, I made, I don't care if the app says 18 plus, I made sure she was 18 and then she got really weird. And she sent me unsolicited pics of herself, which I didn't ask for. You aren't that much different at 18 than you are at 16. The worrying part of this is one of Rich's stepdaughters is 16 years old. If he is willing to consider an 18 year old and by his own words, 16 isn't that different from 18. It makes you think how he views her. I'll let you make your own judgment. My opinion is that Rich is sexually attracted to 18 year old girls that he deems to be kids. He is disgusting and should focus on losing weight, moving out of his parents and being a good father before he thinks about dating again. Why so fucking young? I just don't get it, man. Oh, is that a Jesus fucking Christ, man. There are some sick, sick fucking people on this planet.